Rare and personal Beatles memorabilia will go under the hammer in Auckland tomorrow after a vendor with a remarkable story paid a visit to Webb's auction house. The British-born woman who's letting her collection speak for itself was once a secretary to the financial controller at the Beatles company Apple. Alice Wilkins went to check it out. Personally signed photographs, heartfelt handwritten letters. These are the carefully kept mementos of a secretary who worked with the Beatles in the 60s and didn't think her keepsakes would be worth much to anyone else. I was privileged enough to let her know that what she had was going to be worth tens of thousands of dollars. Among the items she kept, a company policy and procedures manual, an Apple Corp watch, her diary including notes on Paul McCartney's housekeeper and John Lennon's holiday, as well as royalty sheets for Beatles songs and some very special personal messages. There's a letter to the vendor from John Lennon handwritten saying if, he, if she ever needed anything, hoping she was well, love from John and Yoko, and then hand signed at the bottom, just incredible. But the other remarkable and most valuable item, a handful of individual expense sheets from each Beatle. So if you'd like to know what Paul McCartney was paying for things like salt, newspapers and piano tuning, or perhaps why John Lennon was always buying flowers, it's all included here. Miscellaneous entertainment expenses, which who knows what that could possibly be in the 60s with the Beatles. I took them straight to our finance department and said, look, even the Beatles in the 60s had to do their expense sheets. The items are being sold in separate lots tomorrow morning, expected to fetch more than $20,000 altogether. But the current owner, who was shocked at the valuation, just wants to find a special home for some very special memories. Like, how cool is that? How humbling is that, that the biggest band in the entire world had all the time in the world for somebody that was, you know, moving around their engagements. The world-renowned rockers were also just her friends, George, Ringo, Paul and John. Alice Wilkins, News Hub.